Tonight's Verify could save lives in this cold weather. All right, now that the cold has arrived, it starts with this viral Facebook post from a fire department in Oregon. It says power strips can overheat and ignite if you plug in a space heater. So we met with DC's fire department to find out why. You want to make sure that you plug the heaters directly, directly into the outlets. You don't use, once again, the surge protectors. I know it's convenient. It gives you that reach around the room, but you don't want to do that. Now, Captain Young explained that those power strips and space heaters could be a deadly duo since the strips aren't made to handle the huge amount of energy space heaters require. The electrical current could surge the strip, and if there's no fuse, you better have a fire extinguisher ready. And that's exactly what one of our researchers did to prepare for a power strip demo at George Washington University. She met with experts Dr. Ramir Aslani and Payman to Ganyan to see just how much juice those power strips can handle. They connected two heaters that needed 3000 watts into a strip that could handle less than 2000. Both of the units are working uh, and we have some other things you know connected to this as well. If you let it run, uh, oh, it just happened. So our experiment didn't go kaboom because there's a fuse inside the strip that cuts the power before a fire. Amir explained that many power strips are cheap and they don't have one. So we can verify. Don't plug those space heaters into power strips. Go for the socket instead and make sure to keep that space heater at least three feet away from anything flammable or you could get burned.